for the people that never heard your music before, like how would you describe your music like to them? Shit, my all my music made for like car rides and she like if you hot box and you and you riding, you know that type of shit. It's designed for cars. So like you gonna hear shit coming from like you really have to listen. And you have to be you have to be how to hear everything really. Yeah. But it's like I always have a different message in it, you know. It's always an underlying message. Yeah. But it sounds like, you know, like some pimp shit. Yeah. What's um like what you know what I'm saying, before we get into what you got planned for the rest of twenty twenty, like first of all talk about twenty twenty, like you know, this this been like your release year and like coming out and really like, you know what I'm saying, putting it, you know what I'm saying, you've been releasing videos and but all all the while, like, you know what I'm saying, we we lost Kobe, you know what I'm saying, the police brutality is really nothing new but like it's getting a particular type of shine now and and um, uh, you know what I'm saying, you got coronavirus and you know what I mean, just crazy shit going on, like what what's your thoughts on like the year and shit and like how how you been maneuvering through it? Man, 2020 the year of like, you know, just seeing everything clearly. So I mean, I just been paying attention to the signs and what I'm really, you know, 2020 the year to really find your purpose and start running with it. You know, cause it's gonna be a time where, you know, things are gonna be different. So it's time to get in tune with yourself. That's what I feel, you know. And it's evident, all we gotta do is look at the news and see how everything turning out. Yeah. So shit, I wouldn't say worry about you know nothing. Yeah. Just do your thing and find your purpose. Yeah. Get in tune with yourself. Yeah. I, like how, how how did you come up like with the name Macadosh? Man, when I when I moved to Dublin, they were like, "Where you from?" I was like, "I'm from Macon." So they started calling me Mac. And you know, shit, the girls always thought I was like cocky because I don't want to really fuck with them. Cause you, shit. It just how it was raised, like you know, you just you gotta you gotta you gotta observe these women before you really get down with them, you know what I mean? Yeah. So these like mm -hmm. And they were like, you know, cocky, the same thing as braggadocious. So I used to be like I was just like macadocious, I put that shit together. I was like, I'm not like I don't I'm not cocky, I'm just shit, I'm macadocious, fuck it. Yeah. Yeah. So what you got planned, like, you know what I'm saying, for the rest of twenty twenty, like like what you got coming? Yeah, Love and Luxury 2 on the way. More videos coming. I'm gonna be dropping a lot of music. I'm just I'm just building my catalog and releasing it. You know. Promoting it, putting a pretty package on it, putting it out. Well, um, you know, what what's your thoughts about, you know what I'm saying, being like from making it and um, you know, especially moving to Dublin like you know, people that's not from Georgia, they only, you know what I'm saying, know Atlanta when people talk about Georgia. So do you feel like, you know what I'm saying, uh, what, what's, what's, what's your perspective on the similarities and the differences between Macon and Atlanta and shit? Like, being from here, and, you know what I'm saying, do you feel like, you know, making cut from a different claw, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, make it de different, definitely cut from a different club. Like, I don't, I always hear making it curse and stuff like that, but I really think it's the opposite. You know what I mean? But I know for a fact that Atlanta would come down here and bite making back in the day, but still the sound and running back up there. Oh yeah. And I, I feel like the same thing still going on. Yeah, yeah. So my perspective, I feel like making, making bigger than Atlanta, it yeah. just, the perspective on it as far as talent and the creativity and the and the real, you know, shit. Man, this is crazy how much talent is in making. You know what I mean? On all different sides. Like I don't know if it's just I don't know. It's just special. Yeah. Yeah. You know, let me think about